Hi everybody, I'm gonna do a book review on the book Value of Everything that's written by Mariana Masukato. So, you see, value is discussed throughout the centuries by multiple different people, mostly famous economists such as Adam Smith or Karl Marx. The book, in this book, she describes the evolution of value what is productivity and wealth through multiple perspectives of different economists, their quotes and how it has evolved throughout centuries from all thinking about food, farming as the base for what is product, productive till be, the financial sector becoming a part of productivity from being a unproductive thing. She also suggests that the entire comp economy has been focused around rent and the reason behind that is because rent seekers are getting rewarded more than wealth creators because of a misconception of value about what actually creates value and because in her book she talks about productivity how because productivity is what generates wealth what generates value it is the base margin and there is also an imbalance between the rich and the poor and it is getting larger because people who are actually productive are getting rewarded less than wealth extractors who are just in the middle man, the person who sends that product out into the market. She also mentions how the economy has gradually become financialized from banks being just important places to contain money to becoming an actually productive part of the economy and well this links into my study of economics as it talks about Karl Marx and multiple things of about the different types of economies she also talks about GDP and policies such as monetary and fiscal policies like in the monetary policy for example it be controlled by interest rates so she talks about how easy it is to change these policies because the economists that decide how to measure GDP they will look at this sector then they will look at another sector and then multiple different other sectors and they choose which sectors to exclude as part of GDP this way they can control what kind of policies they want to happen for example if they want lower interest rates all they have to do is for example increase unemployment because if they don't include that sector then less people will be actually employed and well I really recommend this book because although it might be slightly complex for some people who've never read or know anything about economics it explains her points really well and then she has good quotes to help support her opinions. Also, I recommend this book for A-level students and anybody above who just wants to get know more about the economy and what their thing, thing slash job is actually worth.